Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Avilash and I'm a trader next to. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of Euro USD. So if you're watching my videos for the first time, then please subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis and do check out the Forex analysis playlist on my YouTube channel for the analysis of other pairs like Gold USD, GBP USD, GBP JPY, USD JPY, Euro USD 2 and many more. So let's get started. So this is the photo chart of Euro USD in front of us right now. And after US President Joe Biden chose Jerome Powell to be the chairman for the Federal Reserve, we saw a huge spike, huge bullishness on DXY yesterday. And after that, there was a sudden turmoil in the market. Gold fell sharply. We also saw selling on Euro USD again. And if you just consider the chart of DXY, then you can still see that DXY is extremely bullish. Technically also very bullish and fundamentally also very very bullish right now. So taking any position against the US dollar Against the trend of US dollar is extremely risky right now. So If you have taken a buy position on gold if you have a buy position on euro USD GP USD then my dear friend you may be in big trouble because I have been telling uh, for the last two weeks that you should not be con considering any buy position on GBP USD, Euro USD as the trend of the market is extremely downside and yesterday when there was a sudden spike on DXY we saw huge downtrend on gold, uh, Euro USD or no. okay so be very careful so dollar is extremely bullish try to stay with the trend of the market that's my request I too have an open position on cash JPY I thought it would be going down yes Things were very very beautiful with cash JPY, but when dollar started going up, there was a sudden fall on JPY Japanese yen, and it is going against me. Let's see where the trade goes. And one more thing that I would like to add here: right now, we do not have any prominent or proper resistance for DXY, so be very careful. Okay, it's an open sky for DXY right now. If it goes for correction, also then it will be taking support at the trend line and bouncing again so it will be creating problem for you so be very careful my dear friends do not do not make any mistake if you want to avoid trading for one day two days then you can avoid because market is extremely volatile and hot right now <laughs> in a market condition like this we should always hoo, 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 uh, stay away so this is the four chart of euro usd here if you have watched my previous video and you are in a sell position right now then please continue with the trade yes if you have taken a sell position watching my previous video then please be on the trade you don't need to do anything but my dear friend if you are looking for a fresh position or fresh opportunity right now then i'll say that wait for some time okay wait for some time because after this kind of volatility in the market market usually uh, takes rest for a while market usually consolidates so what can be your next trading strategy your next trading strategy is let the market go up a bit okay let the market go up a bit if market goes up okay. it may try to uh, look like a recovery but do not uh, do not get um, convinced that this is a trend reversal okay so if market goes up and reverses from the trend line you can take a sell position okay if market reverses from the trend line you can take a sell position but if you see a sudden buying on us dollar if you see a sudden big candle on us dollar then definitely we will have a fresh selling on euro usd again and you can take a sell position because condition of euro usd is not very good at all okay. you can see that we do not have any proper strong support also for euro usd things are very very bad right now so if you see a sudden spike on us dollar dxy there will be fresh selling on euro usd and you can take a sell position but whatever you do please follow proper risk management because right now market is very very risky and please do not risk more than two to three percent of your trading capital because this is your capital this is your duty to protect it okay so and beginners and new traders you can avoid trading for at least one one day or two days because if the food is too hot it will burn your mouth. Bye-bye. Take care.